we'll rest. Beth, look. There's nothing on the other side of it. We've made it. We're at the top. But we can't be there. The dad of the Dolan left, he, he didn't say anything about a rock peak. He said the top was a plateau, a snowfield, where the glacier started. Come over here. Look. There's the snowfield down there. You... You mean... He never really reached the top. It's a double peak, and he never even saw this first. We're the first to climb Latino. But if that's true, he'd be light about it. Time something just occurred to you. Hesty look. Yeah. He could be Dorland. His body was never found, and with his face gone, no one would recognize him. He got the job here at the weather station. And has been living here to protect his feet. And he killed my father. And he's been getting up here in his place. Sam, what are we going to do about it? Our first job is going to be to get down. <laughs> The last leg, darling. Mm. Here's the west wall. I'll just make this rope fast. And... <gasps> My Scott. There. Look there. there. Frozen in the ice. Look at that beard. The skins he's wearing. The stone-tipped spear in his hand. There's the god whom the natives tell legends about. A prehistoric hunter that was frozen in the glacier a hundred thousand years ago. Van, if we can get him out, get him back to civilization. We will. We'll come up here tomorrow with Ferguson. And now start down the rope. Wait for me on that ledge just below there. Yes, sir. Coming. Stand clear. Ben, this isn't a ledge. It's the mouth of a cave. And, and back there, look. Metal cylinders. Liquid air. So that's... That's how Scotty died. I don't understand you. Either. Your father brought them up here to freeze and preserve anything he might find in the glacier. Like that hunter. When Scotty climbed up here yesterday, Darlin sprayed the stuff on him. He was dead, frozen solid before he hit the ground. Ben. Let's get out of here fast. Go on, down the road. Yes, Ben, but you come too. It'll hold us both. All right, come on. Easy. The rope's swaying badly. It seems to be slipping. You're not slipping. I even trying it. Ben, it's Kesty, look. He's up on top of the cliff. Darling, darling, don't stop. Oh, you know who I am, eh? And you probably guessed the rest that I lied. He's down there under a million tons of ice. But there on that ledge. Look. A stone tip sea. The one the hunter frozen in the glacier had in his hand. The avalanche must have carried him down, too. The Chinos has finally come down from the mountain. He had to wait there. Frozen in the ice for a hundred thousand years. But he finally got his quarry, Dorlan. And 
that was the tale of the hunter from beyond. The hunter from before time and history. Of course, you've heard other stories where it took a long time to bring a criminal to justice, but uh, have you ever heard one before where someone waited 100,000 years to get their man? Patience may be a virtue in some things, Raymond, but certainly... A...